AI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 8 uh, Arid Start. So it's the random Arid Planet Start. Uh, I forget what seed it was. It was something. <clears throat> okay, as you can see, we, are, we were kind of cruising around. I'll show you the map. So I've been uncovering some stuff. I mined out one of each node deposit around here. I discovered a couple more copper ones, but I haven't discovered any other ones yet. So just two copper. I haven't discovered any Promethium at all. But this is all I've done. I did, I built a detector, put that inside. So that's been helping. Um, I've been, you know, I uncovered this because of it. So. <clears throat> we're going to take a look at this I can see right now there's the core and I don't think there's anything else to this thing like I just I don't think there's anything else besides stuff that we can just take so I think we're going to do that we're going to pop the core oh can I, uh, let's try up here maybe I just can't get it oh. yeah I am getting a beat on it let me just get There we go. Okay, so I guess I could... I could pop my own core in here, I guess? Hmm. That'd be interesting. It's almost sealed, isn't it? I could take this place over, I guess. Not sure if the... Uh, it's actually got quite a bit of space to it. The design's not that horrible. Huh. It's a thought. Uh, or I just level it and make a spawning pad. Or just, you know what, take it over. Because it's already built, right? Take it over, just clear out that crap. I bet you because it used to be powered and it has a generator and stuff, if I put a core in here, it won't trigger a drone base attack. And I can have a powered base with, and I can make a pad off the side of it. Yeah, let's do that. <coughs> we aren't too far away from water. We're like right there. So I can go grab, grab our stuff. And that way, we're way up by the pole, although... It's a south pole. We're not going to get any light. Uh, you know what? Or, or are we? What's the axis like here? Is it a flat axis? I'm not sure. I think it's... I think it's going to be more light to the north. <clears throat> so maybe we should find a different spot. We'll just, we'll just take this one down. Just take this one down. We also got to head back over to, oops, way over to the alien tower over here. So maybe we should go do that really quick and we can uncover what's on the way. Um, I guess I could look at what this thing has. It's hardened steel. Ooh, wow, really? going to get plates off it because I don't actually own it. Armored concrete. Armored concrete. Interesting. So hardened steel over armored concrete. Wow. That's kind of trippy. I'd rather take the whole block. So you know what? I think we'll come back and do that later. I don't want to sit here and multi-tool this thing down in front of you guys. It's kind of boring. It's kind of boring, but you can see it's, it's going to yield some good stuff for us. I also got a head hit by the stuff and grab all it, I think, you know, because <clears throat> right now, actually here, let's fill up my, I'll just jump in the back really quick. I got to build a cockpit for the back here. There, we'll just, while we're, while we're back here, we'll just get something. Okay, 
Let's um, power up. We are powered up. Oh, fill that up. Let's see if we can get out of here without the uh, arachnids triggering. Do they? Do they want to kill me now? Or are these are these arachnids like? type that want to do stuff to your HV? Doesn't appear to be. Okay, so they fixed that AI. Thank God. That, that was a little bit silly before where it's like every single insect wants to kill your HV. Huh. That would be like kind of isn't like they, oh, nope, they're coming after it. <laughs> yep, yep. Okay, they don't like me. Let's, um, well, let's just shrink down. And we'll just deal with them in this manner. Super loud, sorry. Got it. Come on, come kill me. Did I get them both? Oh, I, oh. got a stray. Here we got a stray here. Ooh. Come on. Oh, he's getting pop shots on my on my HV. Come on. Oh, and I attracted more. <laughs> of course. Because hard settings for enemies. Oh, yeah, I think we got. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay, let's try collecting the meat before any more spawn here. Really quick. These are some of the first ones I killed. Oh yeah, and they got the uh, they got the other stuff too. Oh. Oh crap. Is he gonna give up? Um, hmm, let's, uh, <laughs> I got lucky there. I think I got lucky there. Wow. Should we, you know what? Let's, uh, let's just, let's just do this to him. Okay. So let's continue before all of these things disappear here. Oh, I'm going to lose them. Darn. They're disappearing before my eyes. Come on. Okay, I think I got them. I'm going to grab him too, just in case. Because he's worth... He's worth grabbing before he disappears. Now, where were the other ones? I can't see now. I can't see. I got him. I don't know. I guess they disappeared. Okay. Oh, well. Such is life. Or no, that actually this closer one I haven't looted yet. Right? No, I did. Okay. That's fine. Stick this in the fridge. Okay. And this stuff goes in the constructor. Nice. And that can go in the cargo. Excellent. Excellent. Good. 
pounds are we're getting there we're almost halfway to eight so <clears throat> it's interesting it's, it is quite close to water there isn't it and there's there's like a golem spawn right there but there seems to be golem spawns everywhere I don't think that's an issue on this planet is looking for golem spawns you know there's another one right there for example <laughs> they're, just, they're just like everywhere here, let's get him to come a little closer. Okay, so let's kill him. Get his goodies. Yeah, see that? That's that's incredible. Wow. That's why those golems are so worthwhile, especially early on, like, wow. Okay, uh, let's put this stuff away. Up to 30 Neo Ore, 26 Sath, that'll put, give me 60 Neo Ingots. I'll be able to make decent stuff right off the bat. Wow, look at all that Cobalt. Didn't realize I had f over 50 cobalt. That'll be over 100 ingots. Okay, so I'm doing good here. Doing good. Let's. I guess what I really want to do is see where we can make a a base to the north. Then I guess if I'm gonna take a take something over, right? Am I gonna take something over? We're gonna build a pad. If I'm gonna build a pad, it can be down here, and I'm not gonna power it up. Or I just take this over. It's right beside water. It is pretty good, even though it has the crappiest light. <coughs> uh, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Let's keep heading north. We'll do a bit, a little bit of adventuring on the way. We'll do kind of a northwesterly stint, stopping for golems, and well, actually, you know what? You know what? Let's put a marker on. Let's head back to here <coughs> and grab our gear. I think at this point, or at least get more oxygen from it, we can keep it, we can go maintain it, and pick up all the uh, stuff that's crafted, all the water, wow, I'm doing horrible at driving here, kill them for meat, or we could just go do this, oh, silicone, ooh, I do need silicone, Oh, 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 vehicle port, no! Run away! Oh, it can still get me from here, no! Behind the rocks, behind the rocks. Am I safe? Am I safe? Okay. <sighs> okay, so there's a vehicle port. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm not getting that silicone. <laughs> okay. Damn you, vehicle port. <laughs> Key is to always keep moving and not in the same trajectory necessarily when you're being shot at because they can, they can actually line you up and get you. Especially, don't move straight away from them. At least move on an angle. And hopefully you're moving fast enough that they can't track you. And get a good line on you. Oh, I'm going to get awfully close to him here, aren't I? I back off. Okay, ah! Some silicone over there, though. But what, uh, what is it being guarded by? And there's going to be dudes. i got to watch out for dudes, right? There's going to be dudes pretty close, because I got within 500 meters, 
Where were the patrols? Where's the patrols? I did not encounter the telltale patrols giving away the the location to what could possibly be a dangerous POI. So we're hmm. just checking for uh, spitty bugs. Sorry, I'm a little distracted. I don't want to get shot at more. Okay, we're okay here. Okay. So that's good. That's good. We know where an easier silicone is. <clears throat> well, I guess we keep going west. Kind of... Or, you know what? No, we'll, we'll, we'll swing back around. Swing back around. So let's do that. for patrols I don't see any I don't see any golems okay oh is that a golem oop crash sentinel front really okay let's take a look at this is there a dude guarding it nope okay Doesn't look like it has much. The front cockpit area. Let's take a look. That's what we're doing today. We're exploring. This is something to explore. So, <clears throat> needs to be dug out. I don't see the core anywhere immediately evident. got not much we can we can dig a little bit and take a look okay so it's ground here yeah this looks like a boring POI well, let's look for the core then. Must be buried. Is there is there a core on this? Actually, here, let's take a look. Let's um, try zapping it, right? Nope, can't. Okay, so there's a core. Sure, where it's gonna be. Oh, there it is. Should have guessed in the middle of the circle. Okay. Well, I think I think I dug it out enough so that if we jump down, we'll be under the water, or like we'll be back into the air, and I can just shoot it. Let's try. Let's try that. So I should be able to just uh, get my jetpack and my light and my gun and I'm reloaded. Okay. So I guess I gotta get in the back way. Okay. That's fine. I don't see any 
I don't see any imminent danger. Let's check this out. And let's see if we fall down into air. No. Oh, did we hit air? I think we did. Let's try. Oh, can we just back up a bit? Can we get air somehow? Can we? Can't shoot. No. Bummer. <clears throat> okay. So that means I can jump up onto one of these things and shoot down at it probably. So let's try that. No. Huh. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I'm going to hit my head there. Huh. Yeah, I guess explosives is, is the only way. Unless I can jump up over here. I might be able to jump up over here. Let's try this. Yeah. Okay. Where there is a will, there is a way. <clears throat> okay. Well, I think I need to put a core in to see if there's anything worthwhile. So, you know what? We could do that. We could do that. Let's go. Let's go put a core in. Oops. Uh. Fill the core. Hmm. We're gonna need some some oxygen sooner than later. So we can't dally too long. We're just we're just taking a look to see what's in this thing, if it's even worth taking anything on it. I mean obviously all the the, if it's hardened steel, yes, it's totally worth multi-tooling down, which I will anyway. I need all the I need all the blocks. I'll just take it all anyway. It's just I just want to see how high on the priority list it is, and I'm curious, right? And I'm sure you guys want to see. Although I'm sure a lot of you guys have already seen what this thing. You know what, we can just park right up onto it. Here. Just go like this. And then... We can just like, lower down. We should be able to, yep, lock in. And... Turn the engines off for now. Might as well, conserve fuel. And just gonna spawn our drone. Oop, knock myself back in. Thank you very much. Okay. So now we're comfy cozy in our hover vehicle. And I guess I'll put a core in. You know what? I'll just put it exactly in where the other one was. Okay, so let's take a look. Let's take a look, see what it's got. Fuel tank missing, O2 tank missing, generator missing. It's got nothing except a cargo box? Really? Wow, with two cement in it. Okay. Huh. Okay, well, what's what are this what's this made out of then? Steel. Destroyed steel and just steel. Steel. Yeah. Okay. It's pretty low on my priority. Like, might not get actually do anything with it. <laughs> like that low on my priority. All it is is steel blocks. Okay. Um. If I'm desperate, I know where to go. Let's keep going. We're going to go to that marker first. Oh, you know what? I need... Um, 
that up, then I can turn my oxygen back on. There we go. Okay. So I'll hit this marker, and then we'll head back, get our our gear that we left in the lake, and we'll have a whole bunch of water by then, and a whole bunch of O2. So we should. We should be able to go for a long time. First, we should be able to go do the uh, Robson protocol on this one. So we, we discovered some more iron. Where was that? Over there. Oh, Pro Promethium. Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where did we get that? Right over here. So just on the outskirts of this biome. Let's see, is it being guarded by anything? It shows a couple more things over that direction. Let's see how close we can get before we start getting shot at by something. I don't see any, um, I don't see any Xerax. Wow, can I like get right up to this thing and, and maybe potentially mine it? Oh, what's, it's some, oh, spider, yeah. Spiders. Oh, shut up. Really? Really? Does every single insect need to go after freaking inanimate, well, animate, inanimate objects? <laughs> okay, well, I'll take his bits. I'll take his bits, because. got good bits actually all that stuff is very useful for for uh, the higher end mats needed for healing stuff okay wow so I think I could do it I'll be able to jump in the back there and mine that so that's really good I'm really happy and it says medium so okay well I'm gonna come back to that I'm gonna come back to that we don't necessarily need it right now I have a fair amount of biofuel so I'll come back to that and mine that off camera so that's awesome that's really good oh, 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 golem 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 we we stop for golems we stop for golems Oh, damn spiders. Oh, I need more thrust. <laughs> damn. Is he going to run? No, he's coming after me. Okay, that's fine. I got to build some more thrusters. And some more RCS. I can't actually steer it very well yet. There we go. Kill him. Okay, let's see what this golem had. Ooh. Yummy. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we'll get the spider's bits. I definitely need to make a cockpit for the inside of this thing so that I don't get uh, shot at by spin bugs and stuff when I jump out of my cockpit. Okay. Uh, so let's just continue with the plan. Continuing this way. We'll pass these spiders. Get to the marker. Clear the marker. 
and continue on to our emergency generator. And I know it says to the north there, there's probably, well, to the north is potentially more promethium. So let's just, let's take a peek. Because I think that's what, that's all that there is in mountains is promethium from what I remember. So if there's, and I don't think there's any POIs in mountains, unless they're crashed wrecks or something like Titans and stuff. But. So let's take a look. We might get lucky. Keeping our eyes open for patrols, just in case that it is a POI. And it could be, it could be there's multiple of them. Well, it kind of went to the west now. So that means it's northwest. Iron, okay. I probably passed a whole bunch of golems, didn't I? I wasn't really looking for them, I was looking for patrols. Okay, well, let's uh, get our get our gear. So that was not Promethium in, in the hills. Oh. <laughs> Come on! Right at the last second there, you clip something that flips you sideways and you get stuck. That would have been death if that was real life. Death. Ugh. This thing just has no thrusters to keep me going where I want to. Okay. So that's the wreckage with all my sprouts and stuff in it. So we'll have to go back for that because I think there's like wheat sprouts and stuff, but I'm not ready for a garden yet anyway, so meh, not in a big hurry. But that's where we'll, you know, I might, I probably should grab it. If we're grabbing all this stuff, I might not be back in this area again for a while. Okay, so let's jump out and we're going to oxygenate really quick here. Okay, that's okay right now. Grab something to eat. Still got a lot of food, and then we've got a bunch of meat. So we're fine. Actually, I shouldn't be eating my best, uh, my longest lasting stuff. I should be turning that into steaks and eating that while I'm inside this thing. Anyway, let's get this stuff put away. Good, I'm getting a good collection of that. And that, okay, nice. Very nice. We'll be able to actually make some semi-advanced stuff pretty quick here, I think. What's my levels like? Almost eight? Nice. Okay, good. Okay, so let's get out. Turn our light on. And we'll grab this stuff. It looks like it's all unpowered now yeah like I was expecting so we'll grab that grab it nice yeah 
yeah, that's that's awesome. 45 and 65. We've got a ton of, and then a ton of water. So we're way ahead on the O2. Let's just uh, really quickly grab some of this stuff because um, we're so close to, to leveling and oh, is it not okay? So must be that same one that um, I tried to pick a few times now. <laughs> just doesn't it's like it doesn't exist or something yeah where are we at yeah really close to eight really close to eight and grabbing some more of the plant protein isn't gonna hurt us anyway so you know to show you what it's like at the beginning near the near beginning of the game when you're still jumping into water to pick seaweed But it's some fairly safe, easy way of getting XP and food at the same time for just the expenditure of some uh, oxygen. When you're on a planet like this, well, you're always spending oxygen, so that's really a moot point. Okay. Nice. All the seaweed will... See, and there's see what I was talking about, all the plasma, and it's like super easy to spot. If we went all the way deeper, it would be all the other plasma too. You can see, we can see it down there. We can see it down there right there. So I can grab some of that too. So that's uh, that's how I got all that stuff. I just jumped in here and well, I, was, I just kept going around while I was generating oxygen and pick seaweed. Kind of boring, but uh, there you have it. Okay, let's head back. Let's jump in the uh, HV and. Uh, Oops. Come on. No, is it not going to... There we go. <laughs> okay, so our radar is completely lit up right around us. That's pretty awesome. We did uncover some silicone we can get to, lots of copper we can get to, some iron we can get to, and some promethium we can get to. So I think that's probably... What we should do uh, is I should go mine out all that stuff. We also uncovered some more iron. So we can get a whole ton of that stuff. Um, and in the meantime, let's head over to the alien tower and take care of that. We'll finish off the episode with uh, dealing with the alien tower. Oh, do I have spoiled? Yeah, let's let's not do stupid things again. Let's go into the fridge. We'll put all this stuff away. Twenty-six water containers. We can put that into the mobile constructor. Um, oh, we actually need to make some more oxygen. So let's do that. Where is it? Here, it's here. Okay. There we go. And we can put that stuff away. We'll put that in there too. Okay, put that in the constructor. There we go. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Sorry, bear bear with my OCD organization. Just makes life a little easier if you keep it organized while you're while you're throwing stuff in stuff. If you have if you put it where it's supposed to go right off the bat, then it's just easier. Okay. So it's one of these indestructible admin, enemy admin towers. Let's 
So it's probably going to be identical because they got these radiated biomes. It's probably going to be identical to uh, uh, the temperate one where um, the next thing it's going to, we got to go inside and then we got to discover the glyphs, right? Right? And then, and then the wall blows out. We got to kill a couple dudes and then. Oh, more iron. Nice. Okay. So let's jump out and do that then. I have no idea which way this thing's going to blow up. So looks like it's partially blown up there. Maybe that's the side that it's going to blow up to. Let's, um... Let's... lower here how close are we we're really far that's so funny how deceiving that is I just don't want to be close enough so that if those blocks blow up they actually damage the uh, HV I don't know if they would but I don't, I, I don't want to try it so we don't have to go down all the way right because then we can jump in and just move real quick so yeah Okay, so let's jump out. Nothing trying to kill us right away. Uh, let's deal with our suit O2. Fill that up, nice. Okay. And our weapons loaded. Yep, let's do this. So, find signal emitter. We gotta drop down. And then we got to, it's a trap, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, push yourself against the already cracked walls. So there's one of these walls, this one here. And then we pull the lever and it turns the place on. And then examine the room. Okay, and then we go back over to here and hide for a second. Just wait. Can we just wait. Wait for it to catch up. Any second. Here we go. And the red panel. Okay. And now things are going to spawn as soon as I move and trigger the sensor. So. Sometimes they, they spawn halfway into this thing to make an attack. Okay. So it's going to spawn as soon as I... There they are, there. Oh crap, he, he ran right in. I don't remember... Wow, their pathing is definitely getting a little bit better. They jumped up onto the blocks, right? They didn't get stuck down below. Uh, so back to the wreckage. So I think I got stuff for that. Yeah. Awesome. Nice. Nice. I did not have much medical stuff at all before. Pretty much nothing. <laughs> I now have medical stuff. Woo! Okay. So that's another reason why I wanted to do this too, is because I will get some stuff. As I, what else did I get for that? Was it just medical stuff? Was it just medical stuff? It might have been. I'm not sure. Okay. So back to the wreckage. We gotta go back to the wreckage. So we'll go back there and we'll get the spuds, right? Or the. Um, whatever you want to call them. So back to the wreckage. There we go. Really? Are you going to do that with the... Jeez. Okay. Let's correct our height here. Back to the wreckage. And then... 
we'll grab our stuff from the wreckage and I'll probably call it an episode because that'll be pretty long now. It'll be a long episode, so. Wait, what did I what did I just reveal? Am I not paying attention to stuff? Another iron. Small one. That's okay. Revealing lots of stuff, that's good. I'll have lots of mining to do. I want to go for that Prometheum right away, then I don't have to keep cooking up biofuel for everything. Because if that's a medium sized Prometheum, that's going to probably be a full stack of Prometheum ore. So I, wa I really want to get that. I've got to make a, another interior cockpit for this thing. I don't know why I'm flying over the plasma. <laughs> I don't need it right now. Oh, oh, oh. Break for golems. We stop for golems. We stop for golems. Probably already missed a whole bunch. I, I bet you you guys were like, Gollum! 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 If it was like a drinking game, you'd probably be like wasted right now on all the golems that I missed. If you had to drink every time I missed one. Okay. So... the wreckage. Yeah, I don't want to make it my... Not really. No. I, no. I don't really want to make it my uh, base. No. No, thank you. But I'll grab my stuff out of it. So let's do that. Okay, this thing's annoying. Get this out of my way. Oh. What? Did I grab everything then? I guess I did. You know? Huh. See? I told you every time I do something, it's something new to me. There we go. That's what I was waiting for. Finally, the the Titan location. Nice. So where is that then? Down there. Okay. So we we weren't too far off actually. That's not too bad. Nice. Well, we're going to go explore that on the next episode. Um, until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.